Hello Toronto Maple Leafs fan. Want to stay updated on the latest news about your favorite hockey team? Here, we will share news, rumors, and analysis about the Toronto Maple Leafs moves. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on notifications so you won't miss any updates. Despite no longer playing for the Toronto Maple Leafs, Alex Carefoot and Luke Shin didn't spare praise when talking about the phenomenon Austin Matthews. The talented winger has been nominated for the coveted Ted Lindsay Award, the only NHL award voted on by the players themselves, after breaking records in the 2023-24 season with 69 goals, the highest number since the introduction of the salary cap in the league. What makes Austin Matthews so special in the eyes of his former teammates? According to Carefoot, Matthews' daily commitment to improving his game is impressive. He highlights that Austin seems to never rest, tirelessly dedicating himself to the team's success. Shin, on the other hand, was equally impressed by Matthews' ability to take control of a game in a matter of seconds, providing the necessary boost when the team needs it most. Matthews' exceptional season did not go unnoticed. He set personal records in goals, points, and face-off wins, standing out as the eighth player in NHL history to achieve 51 even-strength goals in a single season. Furthermore, his impressive achievements have made him a strong candidate for the Ted Lindsay Award, the Frank J. Zelka Trophy, and the Lady Bing Trophy. His remarkable consistency and MVP-caliber performance place Matthews in a category of his own, as affirmed by his former teammates. However, for Shin, Matthews' contribution goes beyond numbers. It's his ability to elevate the performance of his teammates while enhancing his own skills that distinguishes him as a true MVP, not just for the team, but for the league as a whole. It's truly inspiring to see the admiration and respect that former teammates Alex Carefoot and Luke Shin express for Austin Matthews. Matthews' tireless dedication to improving his game, along with his unique ability to take control and drive his team, are attributes worthy of recognition. In addition to the impressive records he set last season, it's exciting to note how he is able to elevate the performance of his teammates. The positive influence of players like Matthews goes beyond numbers and statistics, impacting the collective success of the team. The discussion about the true meaning of an MVP, not only in terms of scoring, but also in terms of influence and the ability to elevate the team's game, is intriguing. This leads us to reflect not only on Matthews, but on the fundamental role of players who, like him, have a transformative impact on their teams. The influence of exceptional players, such as Austin Matthews, goes far beyond the ice, inspiring fans and aspiring players. His ability to elevate his team's game sets a standard to be followed by aspiring athletes, showing that true success comes not only from individual achievements, but also from the ability to make everyone around you stand out. What do you think about the recognition given to Austin Matthews by his former teammates? Do you believe that the qualities praised by them are essential for the success of a true MVP player? Toronto Maple Leafs general manager, Brad Trailiving, has his eyes on Chris Tanov, a potential unrestricted free agent from the Dallas Stars. According to the latest information from Elliot Friedman of Sportsnet, Trailiving has a strong inclination for Tanov due to their previous relationship when they were both with the Calgary Flames. Could this past connection bring Tanov to the Leafs? Meanwhile, the Dallas Stars are gearing up for a possible battle to re-sign Tanev. Additionally, there are rumors that the team is also keeping an eye on Jake Gensel, who may be considering a potential move to the Hurricanes. How might these moves affect the outlook for the upcoming season? As for Mitch Marner, the future of the talented forward has been the subject of fervent debate since the end of last season. It seems that the Leafs have been considering making an internal offer to him. But will Marner stay in Toronto or be open to more advantageous offers from other teams? Furthermore, the Leafs will face important decisions regarding unrestricted free agent forwards Tyler Bertuzzi and Max Domi, who played on one-year contracts last season. Will they stay with the team or seek new paths in their careers? There is also a rumor about the New York Rangers considering the possibility of trading Jacob Truba, their captain. With Truba's no-trade clause set to change, what could be the possible consequences for the team and the player? Could the Rangers move open opportunities for other teams? Do you think he could be another potential acquisition for the Leafs? I must admit that as a fan of the Maple Leafs, 
The possibility of a big offer for unrestricted free agent Chris Tanov certainly arouses my curiosity. The past relationship between Trailiving and Tanov adds an extra layer of interest, as the dynamics between player and general manager can play a significant role in decisions of this nature. Additionally, the speculations surrounding Mitch Marner and the pending decisions on the UFA forwards bring an aura of anticipation to the upcoming season, leading fans to ponder about the team's future. Regarding the potential moves involving the Rangers and Jacob Truba, it is interesting to observe how such decisions may impact not only the team but also the player's career. These situations raise questions about team management strategies and players' personal choices, which certainly fuel debates among hockey enthusiasts. I see this Truba situation as another possibility for the Leafs. Overall, the news and rumors surrounding player movements in the NHL are elements that keep the sports community excited, sparking heated discussions and theories about what the future holds. Fans are always eager for news and looking forward to seeing how these changes can shape the path of teams towards the upcoming season. It will be exciting to closely follow the unfolding of these events and how they will influence the NHL landscape. What do you, as a Leafs fan, think of these potential changes and acquisitions? Which players would you like to see on the team in the upcoming season? Your thoughts are important to us, so feel free to share your opinions in the comments and join the discussion. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on notifications for all the latest updates and discussions about the hockey world. Thank you for being part of this passionate sports community.